Is this even in focus? Yo, my lens is so damaged. If you're out there and you're feeling festive and generous and you have the giving spirit within you, please give me a lens. I would appreciate that so much. So please do. Thank you. Dope. Yeah, so let's get into the video. Uh, what up guys, uh, I hope you dudes and dudettes are doing good. It's literally 2k18 in a number of days and I feel like gender equality should be at its peak. And I just realized I said 2k18. Ah, oh, Charles, what are you doing? You're too old to be saying that. But you know what, I can say whatever I want. It's 2k18 in literally two days. 2k18, 2k17. And now my cool factor just went downhill. Great. I hate it when people try to just throw a millennial term just anywhere in a conversation. That's why I think 2K18, I shouldn't have said that, I'm sorry. I'll probably end up being that old grandpa who's trying to dress young and be young and he's using all these weird slangs and he's always trying to get you to go and vape with him. That'll be me. Yay. Amazing. I sound, I sound weird with this cold. I don't even know where it's from. I got an analogy couple of days ago. Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked here. Uh, whoa, is that what the title reads? Uh, I'm not doing that. I'm obviously not doing that because I don't even know what it reads. I started this video without a title in mind. So I bet whatever is there, it's just clickbait, super clickbait. So, you know, you can click away now. Thank you for dropping by though. Yeah. Anyway, 2K17. Damn it. 2017. You want the year to end before I have done a video, a cliche video for that matter, uh, talking about how the year has been. You know, the highs and the lows, uh, the lessons and the non lessons. Non lessons? I don't know, is that a thing? I am so confused right now. I have been confused all week. Like, I literally woke up today not knowing what day it is. It's not even funny. I don't know. I think every day this week has been Sat Sunday. And yeah, I just made that up. Sat Sunday. Sat Sunday is when every day of the week feels like a weekend. It's more or less that period between Christmas and New Year's where you're just drifting in time and space. You're, you're looking forward to the new year, but at the same time, you're fatigued about this, this year that has been. So yeah, Sat Sunday. And I swear to God, if that does not make it into Urban Dictionary, I am losing all hope in humanity. Sat Sunday should be a thing. Sat Sunday should be a thing, you know? Legit. It is a thing, actually. It just should be a word that we use. Honestly. Sounds so fucking cool. Sat Sunday, where every day feels like a weekend. It sounds like... A perfect dream, you know. Anyway, the year that has passed or is passing has been somewhat alright, I guess. I, I don't know. But I think a lot has happened this year to each one of us and it has helped you or rather shaped you in one way or another. Could be good, could be bad. But at the same time, I think, you know, growth is the most important thing. Like, that should be the takeaway of the year. Growth that comes, I mean, the growth that could be either physically, emotionally, spiritually, mentally, uh, astrophysically. I think growth is the biggest takeaway of, of the air. That, you know, you look back and, you're, and you see that where you started this year is not the same place. I don't know, I think I'm beginning to sound like one of those captions on Instagram that we see when the year is ending. Ah, I'm such a cliche douchebag. I literally hate those captions. I'm not even joking. I think it's the douchiest, it's one of the douchiest moves. I don't know, but at the same time, I think everything's a douche move. So don't, don't really take me serious. You know, if you want to tell us how much you've grown, tell us. I just find them so cringe. I don't know. I mean, like, listen to this one. Okay. Uh, I really didn't want to do a long post that's reflective of the air that's been because you did. Yeah, da, 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 da. But 2017 has been an amazing year. 2017 was full of positives and negatives. I've always been pessimistic, so I obviously focus on the negatives. But that's changing. I've learned to appreciate the everyday positives, which are a lot if you actually think about it, no matter how small they may be. Done a lot of growing this year, physically, emotionally, and most importantly, mentally. I, I thought I knew the man I'm becoming, but I surprised myself. And on other times, I let myself down a lot, and that scares me. But it's all part of the process. I don't know. No one literally cares about this. You know, the funny thing is, this is actually my post, it's on my Instagram. 
that I made about five days ago. I do not know what I was thinking five days ago, but now looking back at it, it just feels stupid. That was dumb, Guthua. <laughs> I am literally giving myself L's. This is one way to start the air. But you know what? It's a strategy. It is. It is a strategy. You give yourself so many internal L's that you cannot accommodate more L's from the world. So you just get wins. Okay. And, and now I just sound like a broken record here. Never take my advice. It's, it's double advice. Like do it, don't do it, jump off a cliff, but don't jump off a cliff. That's, that's the kind of advice I give and it's the worst. But uh, here's the thing I'm advising against this year. Resolutions. Don't make them. Don't. If you're gonna make a resolution, just make, you know, resolutions that won't actually disappoint you when you don't do them. I don't know, just don't make over the top resolutions. Just go for something like, I'm gonna breathe this air. I'm gonna take walks this air. I'm gonna shit more often this air. Not, I'm gonna buy a plane or I'm gonna join a gym and work out and be, be buff as hell. Just make resolutions that, that are actually, you know, Achievable, yeah, great, great. I don't know. This is this is so helpful, right? Uh, 2018 will be such a great year. I hope. Uh, I just want to thank you guys for the continued support throughout 2017, even through my inconsistency as whatever as a creator. I hope 2018 will be better. I'll be able to put out more videos and more content more often. I don't know. Just hope for the best, I guess. Uh, again, guys, thank you so much. If you're not subscribed to the channel, please do it. You guys are the best. Uh, don't forget to like the video, turn on notifications, and comment something nice down below. Yeah. And here's to another 365 days uh, floating through time and space on a dying rock around a hot mass of burning gases. Yeah. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas? Merry Christmas? Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas, Merry, Merry Christmas, okay? And happy holidays. You make it hard to let you go.